Good morning and welcome to this extra special edition of Green Bay Turtle Times News. Hey, did you hear what special events happening on Monday around 10.20 a.m.? Monday at 10.20 a.m.? Lunch? No, there's this, there's a solar eclipse happening right here and we will all be able to see it. A solar what? A solar eclipse. It sounds like that plant thing that koalas eat. Here, sit down with me and I'll explain to you what a solar eclipse is. Hey guys, what are you guys doing? Oh, nothing. I'm just explaining what a solar eclipse is to Maris. Okay, Maris. A total solar eclipse is when the moon moves between the sun and the earth. The lunar or the moon is what we always call it. Its shadow will darken the sky, bright stars will appear, and temperatures will drop. Depending on where you are, you will experience a partial or total eclipse. Here in Reno, we'll, we will experience a partial eclipse. See, just like this. During the Great American Eclipse, about 85% of the sun in the Reno area will be covered up. The last American total eclipse was in 1979, but did not reach coast to coast. In Reno, the sky will look gray and overcast the morning of some places in the United States will go completely dark for two or three minutes if it is in direct pathway. Okay, so you're saying that a solar eclipse is where the moon goes in between the earth and the sun? Yes, Amaris, that is correct. Wow, so I just go outside and check it out. I'm going to bring my camera and tell all my friends to come with me. I'm going to take a selfie with the solar eclipse. Woohoo! Hold on, Amaris. It's not that easy. What? Yes, Amaris. Now, the sun is very bright, and even though the moon might be passing in front of it, there will, al there will almost always still be part of the sun that the moon isn't covering up. So, if there is any bright part of the sun that is still, be that is still able to be seen, regardless of whether the moon is covering up parts of it. It's still just as dangerous to look at the sun as it would be during any other non-eclipse time. You simply need to, you, can't, you simply can't look directly at the sun without these proper eye protections I bought at the store just for 99 cents each. Well, these look cool. I'm still not convinced they're my shades. In this case, we'll be wearing wearing these eclipse glasses during solar eclipse unless all of the sun is being covered by the moon and that requires a very special set of circumstances so i have to wear these special glasses and not my really cool shades i just got hmm i can live with that i don't want to hurt my eyes plus these are really cool i like them good idea Rose. How about, or what do you say we get on out of here and we go outside and, and watch the solar eclipse? The next solar eclipse will happen until 2024, so we better not miss this one. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Sounds, Sounds like a plan. plan.